Hi, my name is Dwight Hornibrook. I'm a native of Fredericton, New Brunswick, uh, currently living in New York, and have a long history of coaching and playing soccer in both the U.S. and Canada at the college and professional levels. Uh, today I'm here to talk to you a little bit about player development. And so what I'd like to start with is just to make sure that we always remember when we're training kids that this is fun for them. And we need to make it fun and keep it uh, partly entertaining and partly work. Because if it becomes a job to them at too young an age, I think they'll get burnt out. And the research has shown that kids who invest really heavily early on and don't get the rewards that they're looking for will actually quit at an earlier age. So what I'd like to, to, to suggest to you today is that there's always an element of technical training, there's always an element of fitness, but there's always an element of free play as well. Because kids have to learn to play the game and the game teaches them. Coaches, you don't have to script every single thing they do. Give them the basic tools to play. Can they pass? Can they control the ball? Can they dribble the ball? Can they shoot it? Can they play with the ball in the air? And, and as they get older, the game will be more fun for them because they'll become more creative rather than just us writing scripts like they do in basketball and football. Parents, take your kids to the field, drop them off, encourage them, cheer them on. There's only two questions after the game. Did they have fun? And where do you want to go to eat?